good morning you guys welcome back to my channel um i literally just woke up it is 7 23 and do not mind my face or my hair i already really want to make coffee like it's literally what i look forward to in the morning so i'm gonna drink a big thing of water first obviously and then i'm gonna make my coffee um i don't really have anything planned well i don't really have anything planned today um i think me and zach might just clean a little bit more around the apartment i cleaned out literally my whole side of my closet because it was just irritating me how messy it was and how many like how much clothes i have um so i emptied four full trash bags from just my side of the closet it, it's supposed to snow today a little bit um but i woke up and it's like so sunny outside so it's supposed to start snowing at one ish so we're gonna try to get everything done before one because we hate driving in the snow i love the snow so much i love the fall and winter like you guys know but driving in it is not fun like you literally can't see you're slipping and sliding like and i also ordered two pairs of pajamas so the first one i ordered from victoria's secret and that one came in last night so i'm gonna go ahead and like show you guys right now and like unbox it or unwrap it um so the story is i really wanted this pair of pajamas from victoria's secret they were sold out online in my size and since they were a valentine's day collection i thought they weren't gonna come back in stock with them so i bought a pink pair off of asos which still hasn't come by the way it's been almost two weeks but apparently it's supposed to come today but I'm just going to show you guys a picture and I'll also unbox it for you guys. Just a pink set. And like I said, I didn't expect the Victoria's Secret one to go back in stock. So once I got a notification that it was back in stock, I bought that one as well. So because that was the one I originally wanted anyways. Um, so I have two pink sets of pajamas but it's fine because i'm in my pajama era got my trash bags filled with my clothes but it's fine and i had a coupon for these but you had to get a certain amount so i also got a <laughs> another little body spray because this was the cheapest thing on their website and to get the discount i needed like a few more dollars so these are the pajamas I got. I saw a girl on YouTube wearing these and I literally had to have them. They're, they're hot pink with little red hearts and I felt I just needed these and they are literally gorgeous. I am so excited for these because even though they're Valentine's Day, I feel like you can still wear these all through the year like they're just pink pajamas so i am so hyped for these. i literally can't get over how freaking cute these pajamas are and how i always try to remember to cut the wick now because look how much better that looks by the way don't mind the black <laughs> ring around it but i got this little candle wick trimmer off of amazon so i will go ahead and try to link it down below for you guys i love a good candle burning in the morning it just makes the whole apartment smell super yummy so i'm just gonna go ahead and let this one burn and that she accomplished a lot in the short time that she was here really just the type of person that everybody we are going to starbucks right now um this is the purse of the day it is just this 
lululemon belt bag okay a piece of hair stuck lululemon belt bag in the black color and i originally saw this um posted by baby hey like last year and so i had to grab it and now everybody loves it because it's freaking amazing it looks super small but it actually is really big and i'm just gonna put my hand sanitizer in there and my wallet and that's literally all i bring and then obviously my phone literally just woke up zach and i was like we're going to starbucks so let me find some socks i think i'm just gonna wear these pink ones and my ugg dupes but yeah still wearing the same OOTD, which is this like some matching sweat set. Okay, you guys, we just picked up our Starbucks. I got a iced matcha latte, light ice, oat milk, and two pumps of vanilla. Salted caramel cream cold brew. Sorry, I completely cut you off. But he usually gets the Irish cream one, but I don't know if it was sold out or not. We couldn't tell with the sign, so just about to head back home and probably make breakfast i don't know what we're gonna have yet maybe we'll make chorizo or sausage and toast and eggs or something i don't know okay you guys sorry about the lighting but it's been <clears throat> probably like two hours now since i last spoke to you guys we've been watching the murdoch family murders or whatever it's called uh, we watched the first episode of that and it was really good um just really sad but zach is actually out filling up the car with gas before it snows and before we're like stuck without any gas so he's filling up the car and i think i'm gonna make some chorizo and eggs um if you know you know if you don't i'm sorry about it sorry for you but um yeah i think i'm gonna go ahead and get started on that because it's 11 30 and i am starving so it comes like this and pork is literally the best you know on this curve it's just like a meat that you can eat for breakfast and I'm sorry about the background. I need to go through all this food up here. But I make mine with eggs only and because I'm lazy. And I do like eight eggs because I like a lot of eggs in mine. It looks very not appetizing. But I promise you, this is like the best thing ever. And we always eat ours with like in a tortilla, just corn tortillas, amazing. But I always start off with two um, and put my chorizo in there and then Zach likes his on the side and then he'll get his eggs right here and his chorizo right there. Mm. And then we also use a tapatio. Okay, you guys, so this is how they look. I'm gonna put some cheese on top and some hot sauce, just a little bit of cheese. It is snowing so, so hard, but you can't really tell. You can see it falling, but it is so much. Anyway, so like you guys saw, it is literally blizzarding outside. I personally love the cold and I love snow days. Um, so I don't mind. Um, it is. It does suck a little bit though, because you can't really like go out and drive or do anything it's like falling even harder now but i still love them and it just makes you feel all cozy and i just want to bundle up and watch a movie but i think right now i'm gonna go make myself a cup of tea to be cozy and i think i might honestly clean my room a little bit cleaning is like therapeutic for me and kind of want to refold my drawers so I can like put all my new pajamas away and I kind of want to clean up my desk a little bit so maybe I'll do that maybe maybe not but we'll see 
so I could watch something on it while I clean out one of my drawers. We do have, obviously you guys have seen this big TV. It just is super freaking slow. So I'm just gonna use my laptop and watch some YouTube. I also, you guys really wanna take off these old crusty nails. Okay. I was supposed to get them done last month before Valentine's Day, but my nail lady was actually out on vacation for a month. So I'm going to take these nails off and let my nails breathe for like two weeks or whatever. And then I'm going to go get them done again. Um, because I just love having nails, but I also love really short nails. So I don't... No. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I kind of already have these drawers a little bit organized. The top is like bras and underwear, obviously. And then the second drawer, I was keeping my pajama bottoms because I have a lot. And socks because I have... A ridiculous amount of socks so i couldn't keep them all up here but yeah and then the third drawer is like jeans and then more nicer pants that i wear out and the bottom drawer is like sweatpants leggings but i think i might throw in my pajama pants i don't, I don't really know i took one pair out let me put in these pajama pants, these pajamas, Gorgina. So they fit like that, but I have about four pairs I want to put in here. I'm not all gonna fit. So it literally bras and underwear, and then socks, and then pajamas. Um, I also have these. I have so many <laughs> so many bottoms and pajamas and literally just so many everything but i think i'm gonna move these steeler ones in there they're ones i got for christmas from my boyfriend's parents and these are like literally so soft they're so cute they're matching pajamas as well and i really need to wear these more you guys, look what got delivered right now. Zach just came in here and handed it to me. So we're gonna open this right now together. I'm so excited. This has literally been, I don't know. I feel like it's been so long since I ordered these clothes and it's been snowing so much, like I said. So I'm so happy these were finally here. For some reason, I was getting stressed that they were like lost in transit so i'm so excited i need to go get scissors to open them i ordered like i said those that pair of pajamas and zaka sweater because it's his vibe and i just thought it was cute so this is his sweater which I'm gonna just let him open because that might be fun. And these are the pink pajamas with the purple. Babe, you can come open your sweater. Are just pink pajamas with a purple detailing line, and they're so freaking cute. Definitely gonna wash these. But... Here's my red can't get in the light there we go mm -hmm. cable knit pattern on it pretty thick pretty high quality we are big fans of this purchase you like it yeah. it's cute i like it 
Guys, I just filed down my nails a little bit. It won't focus. Don't mind the fuzzies. But I filed down my nails a little bit and I also filed the tops of them so they're a little, so they're not as shiny. They're looking rough. But this is everything I use to take off acrylics. I get cotton swabs and I cut these in half or like peel them in half. I also use um, aluminum foil. I use 100% acetone. And then I use this little nail scraper thingy to scrape off the acrylics. So I'm going to go ahead, wrap one hand at a time. This takes forever. I hate taking off nails, but I'm going to go ahead, wrap my nails with cotton swabs, acetone, and aluminum foil. And I'll try to get it on video for you guys and watch a couple of vlogs. And I also brought in our trash can from the living room because this is what I use always to put all my nail stuff in so and I wore it all the time last winter so I just wanted to get myself so many different colors and styles on the website so at first I was kind of having a hard time deciding good like you can cinch it but I don't want to rely on order a bigger or not bigger a uh, good black sweatsuit set I got one from Amazon but I really wanted one okay, so it is honestly it's been two hours so it's about two hours later since I since I started doing my nails. So this is one hand with the acrylics off and they are honestly not cute at all. But acrylics are off, I'm feeling good. This one is giving me a tough time. I am only halfway done taking them off. I have took off like the first few layers but it's definitely still on there. So. So anyways, like I was saying, I'm going to go ahead and make dinner because I like to eat before seven. Um, I just don't really like eating after seven. I just feel bloated and like blah. So I, tonight I'm just gonna make like a pesto, I don't even know what it's called. I just get sourdough bread, put like a garlic spread, pesto, red, pepper, chili flakes, mozzarella cheese, and tomatoes, which sounds like a lot, but it's honestly so simple. So the bread I use is just literally your basic sourdough bread from Trader Joe's. And we also use this one a lot, if I can grab it. This one might be bad, I don't know, but we use um, this brand a lot and we get this one at Walmart as well. But this one from Trader Joe's looks more fresh this is the garlic spread i use this is also from trader joe's as well don't mind my nails <laughs> but this is also from trader joe's this is literally so amazing you can put it basically on anything i also like to put it on um cucumbers and tomatoes and make a little salad out of it so this is bomb and i just use their there's like oil in here but i just use their genova pesto this is super super good so i will be using these okay so this is what they look like my camera di battery died before i could put everything on so i just wanted to film this quick clip doesn't that look so good and like i said i eat this all the time whenever we just want a lazy easy night so we're gonna eat and watch the walking dead and i'll talk to you guys after probably when i take a shower Good morning, you guys. It is currently the next day, and I was just gonna make it a one day vlog, but this turned into a weekend vlog because I was just so tired last night and I had a stomach ache all freaking day, so I didn't even vlog last night. So I just decided to turn it into a two day vlog. Also, my hair is super greasy. I have to wash it tonight. Like, that's embarrassing. But, you guys, it is so freaking snowy outside again. And I showed you guys a little bit yesterday, but it looks like it snowed all freaking night. The snow outside is so thick. So, 
yeah me and zach wanted to go on a cute little walk this morning but i guess that will not be happening because the snow is literally so thick and i'm kind of sad i like when it snows because i like the feeling of it being like cozy comfy i hate driving in it but it is kind of annoying because you can't do anything or go anywhere like but anyways i follow this one brand on instagram and they you guys know i have a phone case obsession and i love them but i follow this one brand on instagram and they are they have make the cutest phone cases like i see celebrities wearing them sometimes and whatnot but okay so they were having a giveaway on a phone case that hasn't come out yet and it's only available for 72 hours my camera's about to die so i freaking entered the little giveaway just on instagram like all i did was drop my phone thing and i freaking won this phone case and it's light pink and it looks like a bar of soap is that not freaking gorge it drops tomorrow and they dm'd me and said that i won their little giveaway and i'm so freaking excited it's called the soap case their brand name is urban sophistication so you guys should follow them on Instagram and look at all their stuff because they have pretty cute phone cases. And if you're a fan of phone cases, then you will like these. So I'm so freaking happy. I got tagged in that like at 5 a.m. that I won and I was like, I never win anything. So it's like... I was talking about me and Zach maybe going on a walk today and then it was snowing super hard which it actually looks like it's kind of snowing right now but we might still go on a walk we kind of just want to go out there and see what it's like what I'm gonna wear put on my set active leggings I got these when they basically first came out with their leggings so these are like super old in this like blue color um, and I wear a size medium and I'm gonna put these on okay I just put on the leggings and they feel super good on and it's suffocating a little bit and this is my size so I know it's just the material but I just put on a sports bra and I'm just gonna throw on this hoodie it looks to be snowing a little bit so I don't know okay so we did make it out here it's not as bad anymore because now it's sunny Okay, you guys, so here is my pasta, put some meatballs in it, and then for my side of veggies, I'm just having some cucumber and tomatoes with the garlic spread from Trader Joe's. So freaking good. These are so freaking amazing, so I'm going to have this with my food as well, and I usually try to only drink these with dinner, but I'm going to shake it up a little bit, and yeah, so we're just going to eat and watch The Walking Dead. face mask but i don't think i'm gonna do that anymore i think i'm gonna do eye patches um and then do like my moisturizer and stuff but i'm gonna ask zach and see if he still wants to do a face mask but it's already now i used this combination for my body care the sol de janeiro brazilian bum bum cream this is like the small size and then you guys already know I have been loving this body mist. It's the Being French Soothing Comfort Cashmere Vanilla. Literally 
so freaking good it's into a perfume so that's what i'm wearing on my body my face is looking super red tonight i'm not too sure why it's just maybe because i took a warm shower but i think i'm gonna use these little eye patches they're cow print and if you know me you know i love cow print so i think i'm gonna put these on and i really need some lip balm how cute which way these are supposed to go but i usually always feel like you have to put the big part under your eyes i'm not too sure and i could be wrong these are very slimy they're so cute So I'm just going to keep these on. I think it says for 15 minutes. And then I just need to put on some lip balm because, girl, my lips are so dry. This, but that's okay. It's in the vanilla color, so like the clear shade. I am just going to go sit in the living room for a little bit with these on. And I will talk to you guys in a little bit. Oh, God. I am back and i'm gonna do my skincare and also brush my hair but i'm just gonna take these off even though they're so freaking cute it feels so good and now i'm just going to use my little luna oil and do the dot a dot and like I said I have like really dry skin on my forehead and this kind of just smooths it out this also reduces the look of redness and pores so this is just amazing it feels so good and take my drunk elephant moisturizer this moisturizer is literally freaking amazing and it doesn't break me out which i've tried a bunch of moisturizers and obviously as you guys know and can tell i had really bad acne and just really sensitive skin so i try not to you know i try to find stuff that is like clean or just doesn't have a lot of ingredients or just won't break me out okay and now that my skincare is done i'm just gonna do my hair which i think i told you guys i literally just do if i can find it the, it's a 10 which is like the og i'm not too like good at hair products like i never know what kind of hair products to use um i don't know i'm just not good at hair but i try to be like you guys saw i was oiling my hair and everything but i'm just not good at it so i literally use the most basic products like this is my heat protectant i've been using this since like middle school i was using the this one which i still do sometimes don't really like notice a difference with that one and any other one even like that six dollar one from target so i just use the one from target because whatever <laughs> tomorrow is monday so it is the start of a new week and i really don't want to go to work i am so tired and i feel like i'm just burnt out um I'm just always tired, so I'm not really looking forward to going. I don't think anyone really likes to go to work, but like, especially if you don't really like your job. Guys, I'm not even kidding you. I swear this literally on everything because it's a hair, body, and linen mist. I literally spray this thing on everything. It smells so amazing. I don't think I've smelled 
anything like it like no perfume no other body spray i don't even know how to describe it um right now i think i'm just gonna go on my phone a little bit and zach is just playing a video game so i think i'm just gonna watch some youtube i was gonna start editing this vlog but honestly i'm tired guys i'm beat and you guys know that this weekend was like cozy and like not really doing anything okay you guys i think it is 10 o'clock or something i don't know my phone's over there we are getting ready to go to bed we both have work early tomorrow and zach has a doctor's appointment early in the morning so he has to get ready for that i'm gonna put these away i washed these earlier and i was letting them air dry i washed these that i'm wearing too but they just dried faster and i was just gonna wear them out of the package but i was like that's dirty so i had to wash them and i like to air dry a lot of my stuff because i just don't want anything to like shrink or get ripped so yes thank you guys so much for watching this vlog i hope you guys enjoyed this like cozy weekend at home it was like we didn't really do much but like i said it was like snowing the whole weekend so you, we don't really like go out anywhere when it snows so. but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this vlog don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i will talk to you guys in my next one